Bruce Farrell! Roast Battle is officially brought to you by hatred, <laughs> misogyny, and of course, weed! <laughs> and now your host, he is the roast master of roast battle, Brian Motherfucking Moses. Check, check, check in. Hey, battle, 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 battle. Roast battle fans, welcome to Jam in the Van. I'm your host, Brian Motherfucking Moses. This is my co-host right here. Keep it going for Autistic Thunder, everybody. <laughs> That's right, the L.A. version, yeah. That's right, the internet only sees the Texas version. In L.A., we have autism. Yes! Homelessness and autism, baby. That's what California is known for. Everybody! Mercury poisoning! Mercury! Mercury poisoning! It's hard to chant, don't trip, we're good. Uh, I can see why people want to kill the Jews now. Good to be here, everybody. This is the Rose Battle. Are we excited tonight? Yeah! This is a good one. This is the Bay versus L.A. Those NorCal motherfuckers versus us uh, Southern California degenerates. Let's have some fun. First battle. Actually, you know what? We have, we have judges here, guys. This is the oh, Rose yeah. Battle, right? We got to do the whole judges thing. Uh, let's bring up our judges. First guy to bring up the stage, he's the commissioner of the San Francisco Roast Battle League. Make it loud for Josh Means! Josh, yay! Yeah. Josh, number two! Yes. Hell yeah. Thanks yes. for having us. Laurel and hardly functioning. Hell yeah. I love it. Josh, welcome to Los Angeles. Hell yeah. Thanks for having me. This is going to be a fun battle. We've got some of San Francisco's most average. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Some mid motherfuckers. Uh, this lady coming to this, the, uh, the judges' table, I guess. Uh, she's roast battle before on television. She's got a special out right now. Keep it going for my lady. Suba Arguel White. <laughs> so, I know Suba Arguel is your, uh, your stage name. Are you taking your husband's last name? Sean White, by the way, started the Chicago Rose Battle years, years, years ago. I love that cat. That's who she married. Make a lot for her husband, Sean White. This is Suba, but she's here. Anyway. Are you asking me if I'm going to change my name to Suba White? <laughs> All right. Yes, yes, Josh. Yes, it is. Yes, you, you did it, Josh. You, you you found out what we were doing there. <laughs> uh, I love being in a basement chanting "Super White." Feels like a rally. Anyway, yes, I was asking that, but I guess not anymore. I'll never ask that question again to a to an Indian woman who marries a white man from Chicago. Uh, <laughs> all right, this last guy coming to the stage is the season two champion of Rose Battle. Make up for Frank Castillo. Yes. Hell yeah. Frank, man, you are <laughs> leaning into this Mexican thing. Hell yeah, dude. Come on. <laughs> Me could have sown. I don't know what I just said. Yeah. Oh, uh. No, you look good. You look like a Thank cartel you. boss. You look good. <laughs> I look uh, like I do RT, IT for cartel. Uh, <laughs> you do it. <actually. laughs> All right, uh, Frank, you're from both places. You're from the Bay and you're from Southern California. Yes. But you started st uh, stand-up in San Diego, or sorry, Southern California, right? Yeah. All right, and you've been up to San Francisco to see these guys battle. What do you think of San Francisco? I love the San Francisco battlers. It's cool to see uh, them do a sport and just, you know, as the scene grew here, also see how they grew up there. And I've watched a lot of the battlers there. I love them. Also, Josh Beans runs a great show up there, so I'm very excited to see what we're right, Is there a gun behind your back? <laughs> 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 what was that? <laughs> I really love the battles everywhere. Josh Beans is really good. <laughs> Holy shit! That's everything I paid. You can't see what's ha happening under the table right now, but uh, yeah. there is a knife. <laughs> oh, stereotypical. All right. Let's have some fun here, guys. Uh, this first battle coming to the stage. Ladies first from Los Angeles. Make a lot for Alyssa Poteet! <laughs> Yeah. yeah, it's very dry. No music, just autism. 
<laughs> Sorry about that, Pope Sorry. All right. Hi, Brian. Good to see you. Good to see you. Now, where are you from originally? Chicago. Chicago, but you're here in Los Angeles. How long you been here? Like 10 years. 10 years. Been battling how long? Uh, like one and a half. One and a half. You're an old champion. Now, you're battling David Rodriguez, this uh, tiny, I don't, ethnically ambiguous man from <laughs> the Bay Area. What do you think about this cat? Uh, you know, uh, David told me that his girlfriend recently cheated on him. So, uh, yeah, we're just starting by bringing that up, I guess. You know, but I did feel like it would be nice, you know, for him to get to, like, come out here and represent the Bay Area while his Bay's area is getting dicked down by other dudes, you know? <laughs> That's how you fucking intro! <laughs> All right, well, listen, I feel very sad for this man, and I hope he wins tonight. Because uh, he needs this. From Davis, California, make love for my man David Rodriguez! Good to see you, baby. Good to see you. Hey. Nice. Welcome to Los Angeles. Say hi to David Rodriguez, everybody. Nice. Now, looking at you, I wouldn't have guessed you would ever have a girlfriend. So, the fact she cheated on you makes perfect sense. I get around. Very Tupac of you. Very, very Tupac of you. All right, well, this, uh, this Barbie lady here made fun of you here. What do you think about this? Yeah, my ex did cheat on me. Um, she's probably calling another dude daddy. Something that her aborted baby can't do. Oh. <laughs> this is the shit I like! <laughs> One round, five jokes in English. Oh. <laughs> Alyssa, David, who's going first? She can go first. Damn right she is, white privilege. Let's do this! <laughs> the bank! LA, let's roll! Thank you for letting a woman come first for once. Okay, guys, give it up for David. He just learned how to walk without his polio sticks. Yeah. David, you kind of remind me of the band Weezer because he's got to take breaks during sex to hit his inhaler. That's pretty good, Trader Ho. Thank you, Carlos. Men see your woman naked more than you do. Yeah, Alyssa looks like Vladimir Puta. Uh, and you look like Harry Potter in the order of the penises lining up to fuck your girl right now. Uh, David, how do you look like an adult boy? <laughs> David looks like Benjamin Button if he took puberty blockers. Yeah, uh, Alyssa actually slept with Jared Leto, uh, the actor. Before kinda... Suicide Squad, okay. Yeah, I mean, the next morning, that's when he uh, realized he needed to join uh, the Suicide Squad. Uh... <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Mario. Low testosterone. Um, <laughs> yes, uh, D David is Mexican, uh, but this is crazy because, like, no matter how wet his back is, he still makes pussies dry. <laughs> That's pretty good, Zoe 5150. Alyssa, when she was 19, she actually, what, she did get 51 50 would And uh, that's actually how much she charges for a blowjob. <laughs> Do you know who's not getting charged for a blowjob? All the dudes fucking your girl right now. <laughs> Last joke. Oh, God, Liz, oh. Uh, David loves soccer, but uh, he insists on calling it football uh, because he desperately wants his balls to drop closer to his feet. <laughs> like a child. You look like a, you look like a pedophile in a Disney Channel original movie, okay? And he you, comes in the Disney Channel logo. Boop, 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 boop. Thank you. And you look like, uh, you look like Lady Gaga. <laughs> yeah, uh, Alyssa has 
actually slept with some famous soccer players. It was actually in the news. Remember that Thai team that got stuck in a cave? <laughs> Folks, keep it going. Dudley Rodriguez and Alyssa Poteet. Man. Wow. I'm down. Wow. Yes. Wow. <laughs> This does look like two people in the, uh, the sex trafficking community. It really does. The Mexican man and some kind of white woman. Uh, let's start with the lady here. What'd you think about this battle? Uh, I mean, you both did an amazing job, but I mean, Lady Kaka, fuck, dude. It was there the whole time. <laughs> I've never heard anyone use Kaka in a roast battle, and oh my god, I'm so excited. Yeah. <laughs> He called it. her Vladimir Punta. <laughs> yeah, it's so good. I mean, no, I'll let you finish. Right? No, no, man. I mean, if it wasn't for the fact that you were had to do the roast battle in English, I would have given it to you, but you broke the rules. I did say that, but I think I'm going to allow it. Lady Kaka's really good. It was Spanglish. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I'm kidding. <laughs> so you like... Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna have to go, David, on this one. Oh shit! This one for David. Yeah, yeah. First off, it's pronounced David. Um, yeah, I loved everything. Vladimir Puta, um, the Ma I lo listen. You had good jokes too. Yeah, the Mario Loti, the wet back pussy's dry. Uh, the only thing, the only thing I would say is, uh, like his uh, lady's pussy, you really beat that joke to death. You know what I mean? Like it was really, but it was still pretty good. Um, what else do I have here? Oh. Uh, you look like dad pays my bills, Barbie. <laughs> and David looks like the guy whose wife fucks a student. Oh! Uh -huh. yeah. This is all take. <laughs> but yeah, oh. David wins it for me. That was great, dude. So good. Yeah. <laughs> Wet back pussy dry. That is a, a fucking bar. Uh, that's a clean sweep, though, but go ahead. Uh, yeah, this was a fun battle. That hug at the end was very awkward. <laughs> The hugs that you see at the AVN Awards. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> this felt like interracial couple Barbie. The fucking participation trophy wife versus her pool boy. <laughs> <laughs> you guys fucking said Frank does IT for the cartel. <laughs> David. Uh, David looks like. Uh, hang on. <laughs> <laughs> it's that Bay Area education. Uh, David looks like he has to get that jacket back to Ross Dress for Less before midnight. Shit! Yeah. <laughs> Damn, werewolf dress for less? That's fucked up. <laughs> yeah, you get him at the corner in front of Home Goods. <laughs> True. Like we do look like we're in a community play called Hustle and Flow right now. <laughs> <laughs> because I'm a pimp, she's a hoe, and he's a, he's a John. Anyway, yeah, this is uh, anyway. great. Alyssa, I liked Adult Boy, the Carlos Mencia joke, but uh, I have to give it to David. Hey! Ladies and gentlemen, from the Bay Area, make it up for Davi Rodriguez! One more hug, hug each other, you two, make it count! Hey, one more time! Hello! 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 Hell yeah. Hello! Keep it going. Hey, will those titties keep jumping, folks? Come on. Hello! Hello! You're good, you're good, you're good. It helps him lose weight. Come on now, sure. All right, this is exciting. Uh, two more people. This is, this is Los Angeles in the Bay, so we're going to see some things that people outside of the state don't like. So let's have some fun with these people. Uh, this person coming to the stage, we love so much. Make a lot for Effie Meadows! Yes! Keep it going for Effie. Yes. Yes. Good to see you. Nice hair. All right. Uh, Effie, welcome to the show. Let me do it. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Let me do it. Wow. It's been a rough month. Has it? Oh, yeah. What's wrong? I was 5150. Were you really? Oh. Congratulations. You're a real woman, though. No, the woman didn't like that one. All right. Uh, <laughs> welcome back to the show. You battled Dakota Fry from the Bay Area. Why are you doing this to us? 
Uh, you know, I just like, I've been hearing so much about this whole like war with Israel thing and I thought it'd be fun to get in. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> He's Jewish? Okay. I didn't know. I had to make sure. It makes sense when you see him. Yeah. Um, I don't really know that, but <laughs> let's meet this person from the Bay Area, Mega Loud, Dakota Fry! Yeah! Wow. Wow. You know what? I get it now. Wow. Wow. What up, Jewish Stavros? Good to see you. You're battling. Uh, you're battling Effie here. Why? Yeah. Why are you trying to get canceled? Hey, look. I just came down here to jam in the van with a man trapped in a man. I like this. I like this. Yeah. Jews can't get canceled right now because they're, all, they're in war. So this is fun right now. They can say anything. And they can say anything, too. Let's have some fucking fun here, all right? A lot of things that we said here. This is Dakota. This is Effie. Who's going first? Uh, I can go first. You got this? Sure. Goddamn yeah. right. This is Effie. This is Dakota. Bay, LA. Let's roast! Uh, Dakota, thanks for letting me roast you tonight before you have to go into hibernation. Uh, <laughs> Uh, uh, Dakota's fat, but also addicted to opioids. His favorite snack's a fentanilla wafer. Oh. <laughs> yeah, uh, his mom is dying right now, um, but <laughs> lucky him because she can will him all the morphine. Oh. <laughs> all right, thank you, Dyke Tyson. Oh. <laughs> that tooth gap is crazy. <laughs> I thought I had fucked up teeth. All right, guys. Back when Effie was a man, she couldn't punch her wife. But if you can't beat him, join him. <laughs> All right. Yeah, you look like if Donkey Kong only kidnapped Jewish princesses. <laughs> uh, Dakota's teeth, they're so crooked, they turned into a Star of David before he converted to Judaism. <laughs> Uh, thank you, Ellen DeGender switched. <laughs> Effie loves Taylor Swift and skateboarding. Put them both together, you have half girl Levine. She was a skater boy, she said to her dick later, boy, it wasn't big enough for her. Uh, you look like if Jonah ate the whale. <laughs> uh, you look like if David ate Goliath. Uh, yeah, um... Dakota is a vegetarian for religious reasons, but he does still eat fish and uh, Christian babies. <laughs> I'm honored to be in the presence of a uh, great Oscar winning director, Greta Gerthbig. Yeah, you did a great job on Barbie. You were the perfect person to direct that movie because you're also a woman that doesn't have a pussy. Uh, Effie was also <laughs> casting the reboot. <laughs> Effie was casting the all-female reboot of Pinocchio recently. She's like, I'm not a puppet, I'm a real girl. And their penis starts growing, right? Critics are gonna be raving. Pinocchio, yo, she's got a dick. But what is a tranny if not a Jew that wasn't too cheap to cut it all off? <laughs> Dakota has signs of early onset dementia. Uh, he's probably the first Jew to be wondering, uh, oh, did I leave the oven running while well, he's in an oven? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, nice one, Buffalo Billary Clinton. Your, Nef your Netflix special is gonna be The Silence of the Laughs. All right? <laughs> it puts the lotion on its skin or else it hears my jokes again. She looks like Carice if the answer to would you fuck me was Effie no. <laughs> well, that's a joke. You know, you don't have to bomb things just because you're Jewish. <laughs> I know, see, I haven't picked a side yet in that war. Uh, <laughs> I'm waiting to see who wins. Uh, Okay, anyways, uh, Dakota um, was, uh, in his words, uh, 
uh, raped by a very strong middle-aged woman with Down syndrome while he was delivering a UPS package to her. Uh, I guess they both delivered packages to each other that day. No, no, like he was raped by a very strong woman with Down syndrome, or as she called it, Get Down syndrome. No, no, he was raped by a very strong <laughs> middle-aged woman with Down syndrome. I know what you're thinking. Not his Israeli wife. Uh, no, 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 no. He was raped. <laughs> while on a UPS delivery by a very strong middle-aged woman <laughs> with Down syndrome. Thank God she lived alone because you know how much they love trains. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Princess Guyana. Your career is really going to hit a wall sooner or later. Oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> Effie was raised in San Diego, down the road from SeaWorld, which I think is kind of funny because she looks like the type of white woman that'd be outraged by blackfish. <laughs> she was devastated after watching Free Willy because chopping hers off is going to be not free, very expensive. But like I said, you were concerned about the price of that. Of course. <laughs> Keep it going, everybody. Woo! The Bay versus L.A. <laughs> Effie Meadows from L.A. Dakota Fry. Bay. All right, Commissioner, you did say this was going to be some mid shit happening. We had a dropout a couple days ago. This, they were filling in last minute. Uh, hey, you know what? Keep that going, actually. This, is, this isn't easy. A few days of work here, you know? Dakota's also roasted like eight other people in the last two weeks, so I've been uh, <laughs> making them work. Uh, but fucking bring it when you come down here, god damn it. Uh, <laughs> what was... You were looking through your phone like you built an app to write roast jokes. And <laughs> it was still downloading. Uh, <laughs> this was a fun battle between two wacky Adam Sandler characters. <laughs> <laughs> Dakota controls the weather, but Effie's dating life is cloudy with a chance of meatballs. <laughs> <laughs> Jewish versus trans. Both of your guys' family jewels are tucked. <laughs> All right. All right. That deserves more. Fuck you guys. Uh, <laughs> Dakota, I love you, but you look like you'd have to go through the showers twice. Uh, <laughs> 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 Effie, Effie gets my vote for this one. That's one for Effie Meadows. One for LA. Super. I don't know. I think we're being a little hard here on Weird Al Tankovic. If we could just take a breath. <laughs> Damn, I was so excited about that one. Okay. I, <laughs> swear, I feel like you hit the trans stuff really hard. Like, I, I don't know. Maybe work less trans jokes, more transitions. Anything else? Oh. <laughs> Anything else? And, uh,. Dakota, uh, or Effie, you had a lot of uh, very funny jokes, although I do think, uh, true to nature, that Down Syndrome joke also had an extra punchline, so if we could just Damn. take that down a little bit. But I'm also going to have to go uh, Effie on this one. Yes. I just would like to say to Dakota that I think you should slow down, just like the Down Syndrome woman that raped you. <laughs> <laughs> Go for autistic thunder. Right. What can Brown do for you? All right. Um, wow, did you really get raped by a uh, middle aged uh, chick with Down syndrome? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Very Probably brave worse brave. than you're imagining. <laughs> no, I feel like it'd be pretty cool. You know what I mean? Teach him some. Anyways. Um, <laughs> Well, let, hey, I didn't know they named Jewish guys Dakota. That's wild. Are, they, know, are, uh, are they allowed to get mad if you can't get it up? <laughs> <laughs> uh, did, she, did she put a helmet on your dick? Anyways, ah, uh, that's, that's so dumb. Um, Effie, great fucking joke. So fucking funny. The, he did uh, so many trans jokes, and I was so enamored with how you were going to come back. And that fucking uh, cheap 
chopping off joke was such a great fucking rebuttal. It like took the wind out of all the other trans jokes. Um, but yeah, great fucking job, Effie. Yay! Thank you so much. Thanks, Wade. Keep it going. That's one for LA. Effie Meadow! How you telling you too? Folks, one more time for Dakota Fry and Effie Meadows. For laughing while I said that horrible stuff. Battle! 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 All right, we are tied up. The Bay's got one, LA's got one. Let's break this motherfucker. This lady's yeah. from the Bay Area, a former champion. Make it loud for Miss Morgan Anderson! Yes! What up, Morgs? Right. Morgs, what up? Okay, what's up, man? Good to see you. <laughs> Who are you battling tonight? A guy that looks like he's taken off work from his uh, leaving job as a mariachi band. <laughs> Okay. Just, you'll see him. You'll okay. just. I thought I wasn't gonna be up here first. Okay. <laughs> okay. Always ladies first. <laughs> Sorry, we're gentlemen. That, that, that where you're from, they aren't. Just um, wait. All right, but you're battling Jake Hart tonight. You're from the Bay. You're up here. Uh, yes. Let's make. Let's. Everybody knows Jake, right? Yeah. Right. Just wait for it. Yeah. yeah. He's Mexican, sort of. He's gay all the way. Make it loud for Jake Hart. Yeah. <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> Only Mexican Christmas songs on the trumpet from him. <laughs> All right. Jake, welcome to the show. Good to see you. Thank you battle on nice. Yo, you look very good. Guys, make love for Jake. Yeah. He does it. Yeah. Oh, he's dressed to impress. Very festive. Tomorrow's December, though. Um, <laughs> Battle Morgan, why are you doing this to me? Uh, Santa said he'd give me a promotion if I did this. So. All right, open your mouth, choice. Jake. <laughs> <laughs> open your mouth so we can hear you, Jake. Now, Sorry, <laughs> excuse me. All right, now why are we battling Morgan here? Santa said he would give me a promotion. Oh, uh, oh. Yeah, yeah. It wasn't worth it, I'll be honest. It wasn't All right. worth it. You're right, you're right, you're right. Uh, Close your mouth, Jake. <laughs> <laughs> One round, five jokes, enunciated. Um, who's going first? I'm going to let you go first, if that's okay. Absolutely. So, <laughs> <laughs> We're tied up here. The Bay won, LA won. This is the Bay, this is LA. Jake Hart, Morgan Anderson, last roast! Morgan is like the Cosby show. She's funny, but she hasn't aged well. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Faggoty Ann. <laughs> Jake looks a lot like that kid from the Sandlot. If he grew up to be a different kind of catcher. <laughs> Everyone give it up for Morgan. She gave up time passing out samples at Trader Joe's to be here tonight. <laughs> Morgan, you look like your dream is to open a lesbian bakery called Yeasty Muffs. <laughs> Yeasty Muffs! Yeasty Muffs! Yeasty Muffs! Oh, the only thing that goes down faster than Jake is his T-cell count. <laughs> Thank you, Charlize Theron in the movie Monster. <laughs> Jake's dad is very Mexican Catholic, so when Jake came out of the closet, his dad went directly to Home Depot to build another closet. <laughs> Morgan is or was grew up in a town called Morgan Hill in the Silicon Valley, which is funny because as an adult, Morgan's hills are made of silicon. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Jake told me he's dyslexic and has ADHD, uh, but I just think he spelled AIDS wrong. <laughs> <laughs> your, your mom's dead. Uh, <laughs> Morgan's, Morgan's mother spent her brief time on this earth uh, as an English teacher. She crafted young minds into successful adults that contribute to society. Unfortunately, her daughter wasn't one of them. <laughs> Jake's Mexican and gay, so his favorite drug is jalapeno poppers. <laughs> J 
Jake is half Mexican, but fully gay. That's why he always has a wet back. Morgan just looks like there's a group chat dedicated to talking shit about her. <laughs> Morgan, Morgan, if you're here, who is trapping men in corners at parties to talk about their birth charts? Jake. <laughs> If you're here, who's selling ecstasy in the women's bathroom? <laughs> Folks, is that it? No. Oh, no. shit. We have show. more. We have more. Get out of here. I think Jake has real grandma energy. And by that, I mean he can make a mean chocolate chip cookie and will tell you a very loud story about the first time he ever gave a hand job to a colored boy. <laughs> I think that's it. Right? Is that it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Folks, keep it going. Morgan Anderson. <laughs> and Jake Hart, everybody. I love it. You really had to get that, that colored boy joke out. I like that. <laughs> you had to stop the, no, we're not done. Bro, that guy, whoo, that was, that was nice. That was, that was a lot of fun. One more time for Jake and Morgan. Morgan and Jake. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that was crazy. It's like the elf that wants to fuck Santa and the hottest Paxson employee. It's true. <laughs> How do you look like Joe Pesci in Home Alone and Casino? That's crazy. That's crazy. Homo alone. Anyways. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, great fucking battle. I mean, at first I was like, oh, I think Morgan Hood took it. And then it just, in the middle of it, you just started coming back. This shit got catty and gay. It was really nice. It was like, it was like two, like, you know, you know, this is my gay best friend. And then he had too many margaritas. And then you were like, I fucking hate you. And it was like, it, yeah, was, got good. it, it was beautiful. Um, I want to see one more joke. Okay. Yeah. I want to see one more joke. Yeah. One more joke. Uh -huh. One more joke. Yeah. One more joke. We're, we're, we're going to get to the other two first. And then oh, we're, we're oh gonna sorry. Through, yeah. sorry. I got too excited about it. <laughs> I'll also say one more joke. Yeah, I'll Thanks, say Joe. one more joke. Okay, we're doing one more joke, everybody. Uh, Morgan, you went first. No, wait, you went first. He did. Okay, so then you're first. This is a joke off. Let's roast. All right. Jake was a theater nerd in high school. He had the starring role in the musical Rent, where he played the AIDS. <laughs> uh, give it up for Roseanne Bard out on Xanax. Uh, Morgan looks like Renee Zellweger if she never found success but could still find a bad plastic surgeon. Oh. Damn. Yeah. Keep it going. <laughs> wow. You saved that joke? That's crazy. All right. Uh, all right. <laughs> hey. Double Dare judges, what's happening over there? We can't, it's so close! It yeah. is! This is fucking crazy! Yeah. Oh yeah. my god. Yeah. I, I'm gonna let you playing, guys go first. Playing AIDS. And, and <laughs> it's really funny. I mean, it's also funny to watch both of them make look like jokes when they both look like they were just fighting over the same cigarette they found on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> It feels like like oh two God. friends, like a gay friend and a straight friend that got too drunk, and she's like, just fuck me. Come on. Yeah. 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 I also love Jake. You had very well-written jokes, but sometimes you just sounded like a disappointed school counselor. Like, sometimes you were just listing off things like, and you weren't one of your mother's success stories, and I was waiting, and I was like, no, that's just a mean statement. Right? <laughs> Tax battle shit. <laughs> I was like that. You two do like the, the last two people to the office party. Yeah, it's it's crazy when when gay when gay people battle, they just say mean, hateful facts. Yeah, you know, they're just like. Oh. No, I love it. Jake kind of looks like the tampon I threw away earlier today. <laughs> Mexican? Anyways, um, <laughs> shit. This is. I mean, this is. This is tough. Morgan, you know I love you so much. I think in regulation, it, it, it was just so fucking close, but I think he edged it out just a little bit in overtime. I'm going to have to give it to fucking Gail. Uh, wow. 
Gail. <laughs> yeah, soup is tampon, so we're coming. <laughs> I can't unsee it now. Sure. I um. Oh my god, it's so fucking close. I think. I think I'm gonna go. I liked um the ADD joke, so I think I'm going to go Morgan on this. Ooh. one. Ooh. <laughs> well, I can't believe this comes down to the fucking commissioner of the Bay Area. But go ahead, Josh. Oh man, this was this was a tough battle between uh, the hot girl from rehab and the, <laughs> the nurse you don't trust around your family. <laughs> Damn, accurate. I I it was funny to see him cringe when he thought of having to be in a vagina as a tampon. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, that's what I'm wearing. No. <laughs> I was going for butt plug red. Anyway. Uh, between uh, Morgan's plastic surgery, Jake's completely obvious drinking problem, <laughs> both of you being whores, I can't tell which one of you's taken more shots to the face. Uh, <laughs> Horchata versus Horchata. All right, anyways. Uh, <laughs> Fuck, I don't know. This was Morgan. I feel like you might have been a little bit better in the regulation. And then, Jake, I feel like you were better in overtime, but why did we go to overtime if you were better in regulation? Yeah. Right. So I'm going to have to give it to the better overtime joke. And Jake, Santa Cruz to the victory. At wow. Great job, both of you. Uh, Josh, with the fucking, wow. Folks, we're up one, LA. Keep it going for Super Stamp on Jake Hart. Hug each other. One more time, Morgan Anderson, Jay Cart, overtime. Battle! 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 Wow. Battle, Incredible. Battle, battle. We are now to the last battle of the night. This is fun stuff. Wow. LA's up 2 1. Are we going to take this thing home? We're going to go home with a fucking draw. We'll see. This guy's from the Bay Area. I just met him. Very funny cat. Make it up for Anthony Zucaro! Zucaro! <laughs> Now, this human coming to the stage is very funny. Been around forever. They're the best. Make it loud. Julian Fernandez! Hell uh, yeah. Come on. You know me? Fucking cancel. Cancel this motherfucker right yes. now. Fuck. See what I mean? Got this fucking toxic masculinity. Your right Honor! Here. Oh, I'll cancel them all. I have nowhere else to go. All right. All right, I like these Uno shoes. Holy shit. Thank you. Yeah. Anyway, you're battling uh, this cat up here who wants to take uh, down your community. Why are you doing this? This is all he's got, dude. I'm helping him, if anything. <laughs> <laughs> all right, LA in the Bay. This is the last one. Julian Tone. Anthony Zucaro. Who's going first? I'll take it. You got this? Let's do it. Folks, last battle tonight. Let's make it so fucking loud. We break jam in the van. This Skid Row Sesame Street Muppet is Anthony Zaccaro. Anthony is a registered sex offender. He's not, but you guys totally could see it, right? Look at that, look at that shit. Oh, but... <laughs> don't ask, don't tell a novella in the face, motherfucker. Uh, Julian looks like a created character in a. <laughs> <laughs> Your Honor! <laughs> John Wayne Gravy over here. That's good. That was good. Anthony, somehow you look like the Home Alone. Home Alone Bandit. <laughs> Got an iron to the head, ironically. Um, but. Turn on you. <laughs> um, uh, Julian here looks like a parrot that's in an open relationship. Uh, you look like you're Polly with a cracker. Uh, <laughs> Anthony, you incel chia pet. <laughs> Anthony has the personality of a Brillo pad and the body of a used Brillo pad. <laughs> uh, 
Julian's <laughs> laptop got stolen recently. True. Real, real tough month. Now you and your dad both have made the mistake of leaving something inside for too long. <laughs> it was out of his car. It was out of their car. Figure it out. Um, e explain it more. They'll get it. They'll yeah. get it. They'll get it. <laughs> Anthony is what happens when you drown Post Malone in a river. <laughs> I, I don't know about you guys, but I didn't know they made non-binary people this buff, okay? You, Julian, it looks like you beat AIDS in hand-to-hand... -hand <laughs> in hand-to-hand -hand combat. Anthony looks like Bob Ross if instead of being into finger painting, he was into fingering and fucking kick. Fuck. God, fuck it. Get, get it together, Julie. God fucking damn it. Hey, guys, it's all right. We all had a moment there. It's cool. It's cool. We'll recover. He looks like homeless Paul Giamatti. Not as good. Not doesn't, as good. Doesn't make up for it, but it's fine. No, it uh, doesn't. Uh, Julian, it's great to be here with Jason Mimosas. Uh, Fantastic. Uh, <laughs> uh, Julian, Julian looks like you, uh, I bet during the day you run a thrift store like it's the Navy. Uh, it looks like your barber bookmarked your hair so he could get back to it later. Uh, <laughs> I think that's fine. <laughs> Man, keep it going, Brandon Zaccaro and Julian Fernandez. Wow. I mean, it's been a long night and like this crowd's a little bit tired, but I those are some of the funniest jokes I've ever heard in Rosebud. The thing that Anthony put together with like, he's from the Bay, a lot of the tech stuff he was, I mean, just my God, Anthony, your jokes and then you just fuck. I mean, my goodness. This was I great. Do One more Thank time for these two, everybody. Yeah. 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 This was a hell of a battle. Fuck you. Yeah. That's not gonna make up for saying he earlier. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking cancel! Listen, folks. Your Honor. Listen, folks. Black Supreme Court. I'm one of the few black guys who fucking appreciates this nigga right here. Okay. That's, that's true. That's true. Now, that's when I, universe, yeah. he's the only one who remembers. That's a non-binary. I just learned what I just learned what pronouns were. I gotta be honest. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I just learned what pronouns were. Fuck. Yeah. N words non-binary. Uh, <laughs> universe. That's what I've been saying. <laughs> Are niggas non-binary? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Well, them there days go. feels like a slave thing. I gotta be honest. <laughs> That's what you said, right? <laughs> None of us are thinking that. Okay, if you were with a group of black people, oh, them days over there, would you really say that to them niggas over there? Shut the fuck up, audience. Think about it in your heads when you say it. A, a, a bunch of black non-binaries, look at them's over there. You fucking go to jail. Are you kidding me? You look like a fucking... Plantation owner, Jesus. Anyway, <laughs> well, I think it's all how you say. You know what I mean? If you're like, oh, look at them over there. If you're like, oh my God, look at them's over there. All right, I thought that was a little uh, better, but I guess not. Uh, what are you, Josh? Now, shit. <laughs> a little bit. Uh, <laughs> yeah. This was a great battle. I loved all the jokes. It felt like you were taking it away in the beginning. And then you stumbled a little bit, and then you really showed up, and I really dug it. And, but a lot of the jokes were so fucking good. I, fuck, this was right? a tough one. This is a tough one for me. Uh, I'm gonna puss out and defer, and they all judge. <laughs> okay. Uh, he does I, look like homeless Paul Giamatti. That's fucking crazy, I, <laughs> right? <laughs> Paul F A Giamatti. Slide way. <laughs> all right. Oh, I get it. Yeah, good one, Joe. Yeah, good one. All right. He said fag, guys. <laughs> Paul F. A. G. Amati. Jesus Christ. Josh, this audience doesn't know how to spell. What are you doing? <laughs> we, we already figured out explaining jokes doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, gotta be honest, the funniest person here tonight has been Josh. Autism! 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 It's never happened. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, we're gonna be on Reddit tomorrow. I can't yeah. wait. Uh, Shout out, Joe. I, uh, I mean, just incel, chia pet, John Wayne gravy. Like, I just, 
I got I gotta give it to I mean you both did a really good job, but I gotta give it to Julian. I mean that's yeah, yeah. Oh, so funny. <laughs> keep going, Frank. Go ahead. All right. All right. Uh, <laughs> no, no, keep going. What do you got? Well, even though I also uh, feel bad a little for Anthony because I don't know what happened to you earlier, but the back of your hoodie is dirty as fuck. Like, I don't know. <laughs> he fell outside earlier than also on stage. I'm like, this is fucked up. This is a double. <laughs> <laughs> I, get, I get Julian a hug. What the fuck happened? <laughs> <laughs> You know why it's crusty. We know. <laughs> Let's leave Anthony alone. He's got to go fucking manage a band and take all their money. <laughs> so Paul Giamatti and Straight Outta Compton joke, everybody. You guys are stupid. I gotta you, be honest. All right. Go you ahead, Josh. Uh, this battle, oi they. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> this, <laughs> that's a I don't care. They hate me. Fuck them. This crowd is uh, hot. This crowd is, is they're high on heroin. This battle felt like it started in the break room of a GameStop. <laughs> it does look like that. What do you mean this is only worth six bucks? <laughs> Anthony, we all know you're not actually a sex offender. That's just because you don't want to walk the mile to alert your neighbors. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. At the at the end or at the beginning, you were stumbling out the gate. You were getting the pronouns right, but all the adjectives wrong. Uh, <laughs> but then you really came through at the end, and I think it's way funnier to make Frank now uh, actually make a decision. Oh, so fuck! Like, yeah. I think I already ruined my friendship with Morgan Anderson to <laughs> voting for Jake. So I'm gonna vote for Anthony on this one. Yeah, Josh is the right home. Who do you think won, Frank? Oh, Damn it! Yeah, Frank, make a decision. Who so do you like? Sweaty. You like um, them or this? <laughs> you like this or that? This? Yeah. Um, damn, this was really, really tough. I gotta say, I'm gonna have to go with what's your name? Anthony. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go with uh, uh, the other guy. Why the? Other... Why Anthony? Why'd you struggle? You know my name, <laughs> Julian. There we go. No, I'm trying to remember the pronoun. So. Uh, <laughs> No, Julian for me. Uh, only because he really had such a strong beginning. You just canceled. forgot the pronoun. <laughs> canceled. Oh, oh shit. shit. <laughs> Bring me my gun. Well, now I'm going for you. Uh, <laughs> no, he meant he. <laughs> <laughs> no, Julian had uh, a better opening, and I think that even though they fumbled, uh, the jokes at the end still took it over the top for me. Woo. Ladies and gentlemen, this was a good one. Make it laugh for your winner. <laughs> Julian Fernandez! <laughs> Hug each other, you two. Hug each other. One more time, Anthony Zaccaro, Julian Fernandez. All the battlers you've seen. Folks, that's a, that's a tie. That's going to go Bay 2, LA 2. We'll see you next month. We love you, Julian. We're the best.